Okay, here's my Arduino powered oscilloscope. Uh, currently doing a 200 to 400 sweep audio sine wave input. Trigger circuit or software works much better in this program than it does on the logic analyzer. Although I say that and I can see it shifting. Current frequency is 320 hertz and climbing. And as you see, the oscilloscope isn't good for much more than four or five hundred hertz top end because of the sample rate of the analog to digital converter. Yep, complete. Start over. There's 200 hertz. Um, up next, I'm going to go see if I can change the analog to digital converter control register clear bit, I do believe it's bit 3 and that should increase the sample rate by 16 times so that would take it from a 500 hertz top end to uh, 7 or 8,000 hertz top end and then I mentioned in a previous video I hope to add an external analog to digital converter to get it up to 2 mega samples per second anyway there's the Arduino powered oscilloscope bottom right hand corner the time to do a scan is 36 milliseconds in the logic analyzer you would have seen uh, something like 200 microseconds for the same thing and the last millivolts well why is it saying six seven hundred millivolts hmm should be saying nothing there it's back up it displays in the bottom left hand corner of the millivolts that's saying 538 the camera doesn't focus very good uh, that's millivolts peak to peak of the waveform and on the right is a sample time of 36 milliseconds like I said the logic analyzer doing the parallel input PINC can do uh, in uh, around I think it was 130 microseconds versus 36 milliseconds for the analog to digital converter but I'm going to modify the analog to digital converter's timing and hopefully get that down to in the order of about 2 milliseconds instead of 36. Well, it'll be divided by 16. Yeah, it'll be 2 or 3 milliseconds instead of 36. Anyway, that's my Arduino oscilloscope running uh, audio sweep gen on the PC to produce the... Uh, the waveform and there I restarted it again